Let's go, Nobu. You know. Jin, you found me. You handle that well. I should have heard him coming. Let myself get distracted. These people saw Mongols marching prisoners upriver. They had a blacksmith with them. Your brother? Sounds like it. They were taking him to a camp near the Canada Inlet. I know the place. Did you find any samurai to free your uncle? Not yet. But I'm still searching. I'm sure you'll find someone soon. <laughs> Taka can help you, after we save him. Hard to believe I might see him soon. He's lucky to have you. He might disagree. That's what siblings are for. What about you? Any brothers or sisters? Lord Shimura is my only family. What will you do when he's free? Take a breath. Because then I'll know there's hope for our island. You feel that strongly? I've watched him win victory against impossible odds. And after your brother is free, what then? Honestly, I haven't had time to think about it. You're riding well. How are your wounds? Mostly healed. Your bandages did the trick. You don't share much about how you feel, do you? <laughs> I suppose you're right. My uncle taught me that a samurai masters his emotions, like you master a horse or a blade. That's a hard way to live. It's not supposed to be easy. There's a spot up ahead that overlooks the river. Should give us a good view of the Mongol camp. Where's the camp? Tough to get inside. The Mongols threw that place together in days. There has to be a way in. Let's look. We need to reach Taka, without putting him in danger. We'll find a safe approach. You could scale the rocks on that side. If they're loose, they might give way. Alert the guards. Defenses in back are formidable. The front wall there is still under construction. Could be a way in. We can look for a gap in the front wall. Slip inside. And cut down the Mongols where they stand. If something goes wrong, they'll kill the prisoners. I've seen them do it. We have to go in quietly. Like thieves. What's wrong with that? Before the samurai, this island was ruled by criminals. We changed that by creating order and delivering justice in the open. We live by a code of honor. And sometimes we die by it. Warriors like my father, who just wanted to give us a safer home. I want the same thing, but we have to fight back. 
promised my uncle I'd never break our code. Then bend it. To save my family. And what's left of yours. Let's get a closer look. See what we're up against. We should wait until it gets darker. Let's move. Taka, he's been through a lot, even before the invasion. But you took care of him. Someone had to. He hated when I stole. But it was that or Star. I didn't have a choice. I didn't choose to be a samurai either. But going against my instincts, my code. It's better than getting wiped out by the Mongols. We have to fight back. Any way we can. Through here. See us, they'll kill the prisoners. Then we better stay quiet. And open their throats. think, Jin. The bear's running with a limp. Your arrow wounded him. This is when a beast is most dangerous. Remain alert. Yes, uncle. Keep after him. I didn't think bears lived here. They don't. But the fighting in Yarikawa drove some this way. So it's the rebels' fault. We should feed them to this bear as punishment. We are not barbarians, Jin. The bear stumbled here. Is it dying? No, but we're getting closer. Stay ready, Jin. Yes, Uncle. If it's still alive, can I take the shot? Prove you can control your emotions. Then, perhaps. We got him! Careful. He could still be alive. This arrow should not have killed him. Look, Uncle. There's a gash in his side. Not from an arrow. An assassin! From Yarikawa! Traitor! You would stab the Chido in the back! Rosakai! Control yourself. We are not criminals like this man here. We are samurai. He tried to kill you! He must answer for this crime with his life. And look him in the eye. And teach him that samurai never acts out of anger or fear. And take his life with honor. <laughs> when we fight, we face our enemy head on. And when we take their life, we look them in the eye with courage and respect. This is what makes us samurai. Only cowards strike from the shadows.
Jin. What's wrong? Let's find your brother. I can't let them see us. Use all your senses. Think and move like a thief. Ching Harwo! Prisoner. Tucker? Let's find out. No, it's not Tucker. How'd you get in here? We need to go. We'll talk when it's safe. Come on. Let's get to the river. We'll be safe there. Are you with the Straw Hat Ronin? I was. Cut ties with them after they started running low on rations. Lord Shimmer has been captured, and I could use some extra swords to free him. Are you looking for work? No, but the other Straw Hats may be. Last I heard, they were hunting Mongols in Tsitsu Prefecture, by the coast near the Kishi grasslands. This way. We're looking for my brother. A blacksmith named Tucker. Don't know him, but a lot of prisoners move through here. You said they were moving the slaves. Where? They mentioned Asimov Bay. And there was a blacksmith in the last group. Young man with a beard. From Yarikawa, maybe. 
You'd better be right. I hope you find your blacksmith. Taka's alive in Osmo Bay. The town is surrounded by walls. Rushing in without a plan will only put him in more danger. I have a friend who might be able to get us inside. Find him. The sooner we rescue Taka, the sooner we save my uncle. Jin. Taka will forge whatever tool you need as soon as he's free. But after that, we're leaving the island. You've seen what the Mongols are doing here. Lord Shimura can stop them. Stay. Help us fight for a home. Home is wherever Taka and I go. My friend lives in Asmo Prefecture, on the border with Tsutsu. I'll find you there. I know this wasn't easy. Going against your code. I did what I had to. Thank you. Lord Shimura. You deserve better than this. Convince your people to stop resisting, and you can walk free. Stop wasting my time. Kill me. Mm, you think you've lost everything. But your nephew is still alive. Jin. My men control the roads. They build war camps near your towns. They see everything. And they will find him. Lord Sakai will fight until his last breath. As will I. You love him. Just as you love your people. You're a father to them. Will you abandon your children? I won't make them your slaves. out of high falls a thief's trick Oh, 
She springs. Perhaps someone at the inn can direct me to Sensei Ishikawa. Another samurai? Alive? I thought Lord Jin Roku was the only one. I don't know the name. He's in Kashimimu. I'm sure he would be happy to see you. I'm curious to meet him.
Come, see what I can make for you, my lord. If you have hides to spare, I can offer you something in return. I'm sorry. I need more for that. I'll make an offering for your good fortune. Samurai? I? I'm looking for Sensei Ishikawa. I thought he fell at Komoda. He didn't. Where is his dojo? To the forest. I can show you the way, my lord. Did the Sensei not fight at Komoda? No. He came to town for supplies the day before the invasion. Hardly spoke a word. But he's always been a private man. My lord, are the stories of Sensei Ishikawa true? What stories? They say he sank a pirate ship with a single arrow. <laughs> Not the ship, but he shot a pirate captain from the shore. Routed the whole fleet. I'd hate to cross an archer like that. Do you deserve death? I hope not, my lord. Then you're safe from Ichikawa. The sensei's dojo is up there on the cliff. Only one samurai survived at Komoda. What hope is there? Thank you. I'll take it from here. One more question, my lord. May I ask why the sensei left his post as archery master to clan Nagao? No one knows. Strange. Giving up service to a great lord for... this. Sensei Ishikawa's dojo. There was a struggle here. Better look around. Someone was wounded. Remove the arrow. Dried blood. The fight wasn't recent. Bloody footprints. The victim or the attacker. Maybe the sensei is in his house. Humble home for a samurai. Don't move. Sensei Ishikawa. Lord Sakai's boy. <laughs> you survived Komoda. We could have used your bone. I was on my way when bandits attacked me. Are you expecting them to return? A samurai is never caught by surprise. <sighs> I'm sorry about Lord Shimura. He was a good man. He's alive. Taken captive by the Mongols. Then there's hope. That's why I've come. 
Help me save him. I can't. My student is missing. A skilled archer. I will help you look. Then you can both help me free Lord Shimura. Hmm. Try and keep up, Sakai. made it out of Kumuda. No one knows. Are there any others who can fight back? Besides us? I don't know yet. You'd better find out quickly. We can't free your uncle by ourselves. I can help track your student. I need no help tracking Tomoe. Tomoe? A woman? From what clan? No clan. A peasant. But she can outshoot any samurai I know. <laughs> Even you, Sakai. The last time I saw you was ten years ago. You came to study with me. You remember? I remember most of the students I reject. Instead, you took this Tomoe as your student. You showed promise. Tomoe is a prodigy. Mongols, take them. Like drunk Tanuki. They fought well enough at Komoda. Even Tanuki can catch a tiger when it's sleeping. The moist trail picks up here. Come. The Mongols took Fort Nakayama. That patrol likely came from there. That's close to the hot springs. The town will be the next to fall. Something happened here. An ambush. Look around. Blood. But not much. No one died. A Japanese quiver. A gift to my greatest student. Rice and millet. Left uneaten. The attack was sudden. I fear the worst. Tomoe would never leave the quiver behind. Unless she was pursued. Or captured. To what end? Interrogation. Torture. Worse. They may be doing the same to Lord Shimura. Fear is a weapon, Sakai. Do not let the Mongols use it against you. Your student, where would they take her? Fort Nakayama. The fort is nearby. I should have fought at Komura with you. Better you didn't. We lost enough there. Why did the samurai fail? The Mongols fought like animals. Wrong answer. I saw it with my own eyes. An archer's aim relies not on eyes, but on body, mind, and spirit. Stop here. We need to talk. What's wrong, Sensei? This bow was a gift to me from Lord Nagao many years ago. It's a beautiful weapon. Of course it is. And there's nothing more painful to me than a perfect bow ineptly used. Then it's a good thing you're giving it to me. <sighs> Who said anything about giving? Prove you can shoot straight. I'll let you borrow it. Try it out before we go into battle. Aim for that lamp closest to us.
the one further down the road. On the left. Not bad. Let's see if you can hit the one furthest away. The further the target, the more your arrow drops. How does it feel? Like it was made for me. It wasn't. So take good care of it. Let's go. A bow like this would have helped at Komoda. It is a good bow. But victory is won by warriors, not weapons. You haven't seen the Mongols fire weapons. And they have not yet won. Fort Nakayama. I hope your student is inside. We'll get a better look at the defenses from up there. This spot is perfect. I'll find a way in. Open the gate. Then we hit them. Do you always charge into battle with your Hakama half tied? You have a better idea? Patience, Sakai. The Mongols will send men to find their missing patrol. When they open the gates, we strike. The longer we delay, the longer Tomoe remains in danger. She can take care of herself. Survey the battlefield. What can we use to our advantage? Those barrels could do some damage. We'll find out. Hornet nests. One shot could stir them up. Mm, the Mongols will face the sting of insects and arrows. An arrow in those hanging lights will kick up sparks. <laughs> and start fires. They have many archers. They're skilled, but we are better. When the gates open, distract the enemy and rain arrows on their heads. Then we storm the fort and free Tomoe. Good. Now we wait. They're opening the gates. Wait for my signal. Now send them to their ancestors. Not bad, Sakai. There are more inside. Not for long. Let's find some way. Join. He was a 
Go! Slain prisoners. Tied up. Killed with arrows. Tomoe isn't. Wait, this pendant belongs to her. Search the fort! These arrows are Japanese. They're Tomoe's arrows. You are sure? I taught her to make the knock with deer horn. And that curve of the eagle feathers. So the Mongols took her weapons? The shots are tightly clustered. No Mongol shoots Japanese arrows with such skill. Huh. Then they allowed her to use a bow. Scroll. Archery terms with Mongolian translations. Your name is mentioned. She was teaching them my way of the bow.
Someone's personal quarters. A woman's kimono. Tomoe's kimono. The Mongols freed her. Why? Do you that? A survivor. For a woman, an archer. The Mongols caged her with us. But they set her free. Gave her armor and a bow. She killed my wife and the others. The bodies we found. She proved her skill to the enemy. And they recruited her. Please. It, it hurts. Don't leave. I've seen enough. Let's go. I should have killed her. Sensei? The Moe won her freedom. And she joined the Mongols. Why would she do that? What happened? Well, they pushed her too hard. Pushed her how? What are you hiding? Sensei! I demand an answer. She attacked me. Not bandits. Tomoe. Why? She has no idea what it means to be samurai. You drove her to the Mongols. Do not judge me. Do not lie to me. I can't let Tomoe teach my way of the bow to the enemy. Then we will stop her. This is my fight. I don't need your weapon. No, you need me. Victory is won by warriors, not weapons. Hmm. Lord Shimura raised you well. We'll hunt them away together, but we do it my way. And when the time comes, you will help rescue my uncle. You have my word, Sakai. I will prepare to hunt Tomoe. When you are ready, meet me at my dojo. We can't rescue my uncle alone. I need more people to join our fight. Fine lady Masako Adachi. If she's still alive, she's one of the finest warriors on the island. are everywhere. In a fight, they will surround me like wolves. I need to find new methods to keep them at bay. A well-balanced blade I can throw to catch a foe by surprise and finish them off. Thank you. 